everyone, it's Jeanette here from Enthusiastic Gardener and I'm afraid that we have had a bit of a catastrophe in the garden. I broke the umbrella, so the cord completely snapped. It's very, very stiff, this umbrella, to open as well. So I always do tend to yank it, which I don't think you're supposed to do. Anyway, so I've given Richard another job to do in the garden. We have ordered some new cord and he thinks that it is going to be very simple to do. Yeah, it's not going to be simple. <laughs> okay, so this video was going to be a very short video, but now it could turn out into a part two and even a part three. Or do you think we should just buy a new umbrella? I know, I will sort this. I'll sort this, but it's a bit more involved. And you think. So I believe the problem lies therein and we have the new cord which arrived today from Amazon. This is the umbrella we have and we will try to fix it rather than getting a new one. Now I can hear Richard is inside and he is on YouTube looking up how to fix the umbrella because YouTube fountain of knowledge if you do not know how to do something someone on YouTube will be able to help you someone will have posted a video YouTube is fantastic and he's not as happy now as when he started this project let's put it like that Right, I've replaced the cord. Now, this is the moment of truth. Moment of truth, everyone. Now the pins come out. <laughs> Can you line up the centre first, eh? What, babe? Line oh, up yeah. the centre piece. Hang on, no, no, no. Yeah, no. Down a bit. That's it. Up a bit. Yeah. Yeah. Have you fixed it, Richard? Richard. Right, it's now repaired. Most people, the cable would have snapped and they would have thought, ah, oh, that's it, buy a new one. But there's always a way of repairing something. 
Have a nice day. Richard is so good at fixing things. He has the, um, what can I say? I'm, I'm the brain of a... <laughs> I'm the dick, uh, dick and angel. Who's Dick and Angel? Oh, Dick and Angel. Mm. He's the Dick Strawbridge from Dick and Angel. Yes, Escape to the Chateau. Richard is fabulous. He can fix anything. If he cannot fix it, it is unfixable. I'm very, very lucky to have him. Very lucky. Very lucky, he's just said. He has whole bags of tools, so I'm not even allowed to go near the tools. I'm not even allowed to touch them, or particularly the hammers. But we won't go into that. Anyway, you've saved me, Richard, £100 at least, so now I can go and spend it on plants for the garden instead. Win-win. Thanks for watching, everyone. Bye.